hello friends welcome to the study of vernier calipers in this part in this part we will study three main parts main parts list count measurement and how to take readings first of all we will study main parts of vernier calipers it has mainly two parts main frame and vernier scale frame here you can see in the screen there is main part or main frame that is called m it has two jaws upper d and lower a this is d and this is a there are two scales upper side and lower side upper side scale is calibrated in inch scale and lower side scale is calibrated in millimeter scale or you can say in centimeter also 15 cm, 5 cm, 4, 3, 0 like that. For our convenience, I have break some part. Okay, there is another part that is called vernier scale frame V. It is here. It can slide on main scale. It has two jaws, upper C and lower B, these and these. It has knob K. to lock and strip s to measure the depth here is k that is knob that is called that is for uh, lock the object which is kept here and this is strip for measurement of small height small depth let us study how to find list count measurement it has two formula list count measurement value of smallest division on uh, main scale divided by total number of divisions on vernier scale here in this case value of smallest division on main scale is 1 mm that is here it is our main scale and smallest value is here that is called 1 mm and total number of divisions on vernier scale is 10 here is 10 division so list count will be 1 mm divided by 10 that is nothing but 0.1 mm now i move on formula number 2 list count measurement that is m minus v main scale division minus value of small smallest division on vernier scale so we have studied in earlier one value of smallest division on main scale m is 1 mm that is here and value of smallest division on vernier scale v is 9 mm divided by 10 how it can be possible you can see here there are 10 division on vernier scale they are exactly equal to 9 mm of main scale so value of smallest division on vernier scale that is nothing but 9 divided by 10 so our list count in this formula that will be 1 mm minus 0.9 mm is equal to 0.1 mm now let us study how to take readings from vernier calipers one cylinder is kept over here in between these uh, two lower jaws and what will be the outer diameter of given cylinder that is my question so you can see uh, the dimension of this object is like this one 6 mm complete measurement and fourth division is aligned with this division okay then a is 6 mm and fourth division is aligned with this one so measurement will be 6 mm plus 4 into 0.1 mm that is 6.44 mm that is here that is here another example you can see is our vernier calipers is very much useful to my measure internal diameter of cylinder here in this case cylinder is here and our dimension will be like that 7.3 mm how so 7 mm uh, 7 mm is complete measurement and third division is aligned with this division so 0.3 mm plus 7 that is nothing but 7.3 mm let us see 
few more examples we have to select the answer from this window what is the dimension that is 24 plus 6 how it can be 6 division is aligned with this one so 0.6 measurement is b value and 24 is complete value so 24.6 will be the our will be our answer let me see and submit the button okay we are right let us see one more example what will be the answer let me see from here 15.5 millimeter is the right answer here is 15 millimeter is complete measurement and fifth division is aligned with this division so 15.5 millimeter is our right answer thank you